Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's home was available to rent, but with surprising list of routes. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry moved into their Californian mansion earlier this year, but before the Duke and Duchess of Sussex bought the property, it was available to rent and there was a surprising list of restrictions. Meghan and Harry's new house in Santa Barbara was listed on Gister to rent for £538, about $700 an hour for activities such as photo shoots and music videos. The website describes itself as the Airbnb for filming location. The luxury property was listed as an Italian villa. It could be rented for a minimum of 10 hours. Smoking, alcohol, pets, cooking, and adult filming were all banned. The sprawling mansion could accommodate 15 crew members and park it for 50, the Daily Mail reported. Meghan and Harry have previously given a glimpse inside their home during video calls. It emerged in August Duke and Duchess of Sussex had moved into the new house, which reportedly cost £11 million the month before with the young son Archie. They have been staying in American actor Tyler Perry's mansion in Los Angeles since quitting royal duties for a new life in the US. The Montecito property has nine bedrooms, a games room, home theater, spa facilities, an elevator, gym, swimming pool, and tennis court. Alongside the 14,500 square foot main home, there is a two bedroom guest house on a seven acre site. A spokesperson uh, for the couple previously said, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex moved into their family home in July of this year. They will have settled into quiet privacy of the community since they arrived and hope that those will be respected for their neighbours, as well as for them as a family. The Queen's grandson and the former actress work the monarchy into a period crisis when they announced bombshell plans to step back as senior royals in January. The monarch house summoned up Prince Charles, Prince William and Harry to discuss the Sussex's future roles. And it was later announced that Meghan and Harry would no longer be working as members of the royal family. They officially ended royal duties on March 31st. The Sussex's new careers included a lucrative deal with Netflix to make shows for the streaming service. After striking the deal, Harry paid back the 2.4 million pounds of taxpayers' money used to renovate the UK home Frogmore Cottage.